I'm Tony Tibbles. I'm one of the board members of Proud Heritage, and in my working life, I'm also director of the Maritime Museum in Liverpool. Um, this is a very special event, launching the online museum representing Lagos. Sorry, this bit. Okay. <laughs> bisexual and transgendered heritage. Uh, much of the work that Proud Heritage has been doing so far has been behind the scenes. Many museums have got collections or items associated with LGBT history, but they're rarely recognized for that association and not categorized or catalogued as such. Proud Heritage has begun the process of encouraging museums to look differently at their collections and to look for these associations. And we're beginning to see some attempts to represent LGBT history by beginning to reclassify collections and also by a number of temporary exhibitions which have taken place over the last few years. The public response to these has been extremely um, positive. And I can speak of the experience we've had with our exhibition, Hello Sailor, which was an exhibition prepared in 2005 about gay seafarers. And though I had the odd letter from disgruntled visitors telling me that it wasn't a suitable subject um, for a museum which was aimed at a family audience, um, or from a chief engineer who reckoned that he'd uh, spent 40 years at sea and never met a gay person at sea, um, well, that's what he said. Um, but really these were the exceptions. And the research that we did with visitors actually showed that most people who came to the museum and saw the exhibition thought that it was an appropriate thing for us to be doing. Um, and that they found it interesting and stimulating. And I think, you know, that was very encouraging. And I think things are beginning to um, beginning to change and that Proud Heritage has got a role in this and the online museum which we're going to see um, today is really an important contribution to that struggle to represent LGBT history and will I'm sure be an encouragement for others to do, to do their bit so you know this is the first step towards a much more important representation of, um, of our heritage. Um, and really that's what I wanted to, to say in support of this project. Um, and I think we're now going to hear from Ben Summerskill.